Hi and welcome to the session. I am Shashi and I am going to help you to solve the following question. Question is, the sum of 4th and 8th terms of an AP is 24 and the sum of 6th and 10th terms is 44. Find the first three terms of the AP. First of all, let us understand the key idea to solve the given question. The nth term of an AP with first term A and common difference D is given by An is equal to A plus N minus 1 multiplied by D. Let us now start with the solution. Let the first three terms of the AP be A, A plus G, A plus 2D. Now clearly we can see to find the three terms of the AP we need to find A and D. Now we know according to the question 4th term of AP plus 8th term of AP must be equal to 24. We know 4th term of AP is denoted by A4 and 8th term of AP is A8 is equal to 24. Let us name this equation as 1. Now, we know by key idea, an, that is the nth term of the AP, is given by a plus n minus 1 multiplied by d, where a is the first term of the AP and d is the common difference. So, fourth term is equal to a plus 4 minus 1 multiplied by d. We had substituted 4 for n. Now we get fourth term is equal to a plus 3d. Similarly, we can find out eighth term. Now eighth term is equal to a plus 8 minus 1 multiplied by d. So we get eighth term is equal to a plus 7d. Now substituting the value of fourth term and eighth term in equation 1, we get a plus 3d plus a plus 7d is equal to 24. This implies 2a plus 10d is equal to 24. Now, this further implies 2 multiplied by a plus 5d is equal to 24. This implies a plus 5d is equal to 24 divided by 2. This implies a plus 5d is equal to 12. Here we have taken 2 as a common factor. Now dividing the both sides by 2 we get a plus 5d is equal to 12. Also the second condition given in the question is the sum of the 6th term and the 10th term of the AP is equal to 44. Now Therefore, we can write 6th term as A6 and 10th term as A10. So, we get A6 plus A10 is equal to 44. Now, let us find out the values for A6 and A10. We know A6 is equal to A plus 6 minus 1 multiplied by D, which implies A6 is equal to A plus 5d. Now, we know n term of the AP is given by a plus n minus 1 multiplied by d. Now, here we to find the 6th term, we have substituted for n 6. So, we get 6th term of the AP is equal to a plus 5d. Similarly, we can find out the 10th term of the AP. So, we get 10th term of the AP is equal to a plus 9d. Now, let us name this equation as 2. Now, we will substitute the corresponding values of A6 and A10 in the equation 2. Now, substituting for A6 and A10 in equation 2, we get A plus 5D plus A plus 9D is equal to 44. This implies 2A plus 14D is equal to 44. This implies 2 multiplied by a plus 7d is equal to 44. Here we have taken 2 as a common factor on left hand side. Now dividing both sides by 2 we get the equation a plus 7d 
is equal to 22. Now, we have already proved above that a plus 5b is equal to 12. So, we can rewrite the equation a plus 5d is equal to 12. Let us name this equation as 3 and this equation as 4. Now, subtracting equation 4 from equation 3, we get a plus 7d minus a plus 5d is equal to 22 minus 12. Now, this implies a plus 7d minus a minus 5d is equal to 10. A and A will get cancelled. Now we get 2D is equal to 10. This implies D is equal to 10 divided by 2 or D is equal to 5. Therefore, we get D is equal to 5. Now, substituting D is equal to 5 in equation 4, we get a plus 5 multiplied by 5 is equal to 12. This implies A plus 25 is equal to 12. This implies A is equal to 12 minus 25. Or we can write A is equal to minus 13. Therefore, we get A is equal to minus 13. Thus, for A is equal to minus 13 and D is equal to 5, first term of AP that is A is equal to minus 13. Second term is equal to A plus D is equal to minus 13 plus 5 is equal to minus 8. Third term of the AP is equal to A plus 2D that is equal to minus 13 plus 2 multiplied by 5 which is equal to minus 3. So the required three terms of the AP are minus 13, minus 8, minus 3. So, the first three terms of AP are minus 13, minus 8, minus 3. This is our required answer. Take care and goodbye.